Howdy, folks! This is Band of 073 here. Cruising the land, putting the rubber nickel, pulling into that car park with the handbrake. <clears throat> Today, I'm bringing you part 18 of my Sword Art Online Fatal Bullet Let's Play. And I was in one thing. Boy, you can tell Silica's grown. She ain't that far off Leafa. The avatars are definitely a lot crisper in the way of the design, too, in this game, I have to add. And one of the best parts is of actually aged Ewing, which is awesome! It needed to happen. Time's a loner! <laughs> That's all I can say. Klein, you're a... You are a... King Loner! Who stalks NPCs. That is not cool. You go home! I quit. I'm going home. <laughs> I bet we've all said something along those lines at some point. Uh, let's see. Ooh, excuse me. Torch. Well, at least in the last episode, one of the best things ever, we found a legendary weapon, which was awesome. <clears throat> Let's see what we got. Oh, hello, hello, <laughs> hello. I didn't know I had that. I'm gonna go and have. I'm gonna have a look at that. Good guy, I'm picking up from you on his ear. I didn't even know that. A little bit to sell, too. Oh, wait, hang on. I'm a spoon. I was selling from the wrong spot. In a box, try selling from storage. Might help. And how are all the caps? That's about it! I don't have any weapons to sell, I think. I think the Kusanagi. Let's go to the bunny quick. For once, I've got two bunker commas instead of fifty flippin' deno kaitos. So I decided on the Kagemitsu. Oh, 
okay, I think. I think, I think, I think we we're getting there. Yeah. Let's just have a range it up. Apparently, my changes in the background too. <laughs> Well, we'll at least know who's who now. <laughs> I'm probably going to acquire another rapid at some point anyways, so... Well, I can act on that one. Let's see, quests. Swing quests. I've done everything there. Shield all the batons, agitated bees. So let's see the finish off there, and then... Yeah. You know what? Let's have a grinding episode. We haven't had one yet. Besides, it'll give us a chance to give me a chance to work at what I'm doing for my channel. And what's next on the channel after this Let's Play, anyways? Because I really, really need to discuss that in a video, so I think it's time I just did a, did a straight up grinding video where I can discuss that. Because yeah, that works for me. Take, we're gonna have a story break, so to speak. Oops. <clears throat> and then we're gonna, gonna get back to it after this video. Now I don't need to accept any more quests. Although, I will go and have a look and see if there's any more that's popped up. Besides the ones that I've written the last couple that I completed. Although, if I go to the third area, I'm going to have to do a little bit of story progression. To help with the quests, unfortunately. But that's all part and parcel of the game. Sometimes you gotta do that. Ah, I can actually see the ring now. So I've had it equipped for quite a while, just because I was wearing an outfit with gloves, I couldn't exactly see it. Loading screens are long! I know XO over Sword Island Online can be long at times, but I think these are even longer than that. Hopefully an update will make them a little bit quicker. Check my ranking. Not a lot has changed there. 916,971. Out of I don't know how many. But I'll say I'm climbing the ranks and I'm gonna shoot up a few more positions after this bit of grinding. Yeah, it's just those ones that I've done. So right then I can leave those, I'll take all those another time. Oh, and as a thing when you're buying um Yeah, weapons when you wanna buy accessories, they're all Commons, unfortunately, which means they're not very good. Okay, it doesn't really matter if it's outfits because outfits actually they actually don't have anything to do with stats. I'm gonna buy a couple of outfits actually. Combat vest. I think that's actually Simon's base now that I think about it. Cash to spare at the minute, so well, what I'll be doing, I'm gonna take a long to get it back up. But it's not gonna drop me to 800 now anyway, so not, not a big problem. 
battle jacket shit. Default. Buying weapons. <clears throat> I'll buy the bikini later on when I get about two or three million. Now. Um, I might have to drop this is here. I don't know. Alright, before I do, I'll check. <laughs> Fashion show! <laughs> Sorry, I couldn't help myself. Let's see. That's basically rings. I do have the male one for some reason, but... I've seen troops wear similar things to that before. That's, uh, I can't think of the character. She's a DLC character for Hero Mode. <clears throat> I think of an anime. Um, I don't know about Flamboyant. Very, very plain, though, besides that. That's, um, Len, I think her name is. Also DLC. It's not her, it's close. I know, I've seen, I've seen footage of a couple of people running around with that one, this one on. I wouldn't have exactly said undershirt, actually. Who? <laughs> Next gen! <laughs> that is futuristic, if you ask me. I like the look, but I'm not going for that, unfortunately. Soldier, huh? I have to say, why would you want to wear a three-piece suit in a game with guns? Unless you're trying to be mar something from the Mafia or something like that. I mean, each to their own, but personally. Let's see, combat. That's pretty much Philia's outfit. Yeah, baby! We got Sinon's outfit! <laughs> Woohoo! Anyone for a sit on? For as close to? <laughs> yeah, baby. Did not know you could just straight up buy that. <laughs> nice. Doesn't really work with my character, though. Where does it? Let me run around. You know what? That actually probably works better than I thought. Probably just my hair and the fact that Sinnoh doesn't have long hair. I am so sticking with that. Now to give Ray an outfit. I could give her that. Hmm. Works just as well on the undershirt. Hmm. Uh, not that one. I think we'll go that. Hey, she's equipped with uncommons. <laughs> Whoops! So she's uncommons. I've got. Epic sword, a legendary gun, an uncommon outfit, a rare beret, and an epic ring. Although the ring probably. It does! Woohoo! The ring still shows, you can't really make it out, but it still shows with these gloves, probably because they're not full fingered. Anyway, enough, <laughs> enough fun with the outfits for now. Now, teleport. Where am I going? To the wastelands. Why not?
This is it. We're having a grind, bit of a gonna have a little bit of a grind episode. Although I would have liked to have been grinding about five minutes ago, but who cares? Well, let's give me a chance to get a little bit of the Australia too. これ Twenty-nine percent. Jeez, the infinity really goes up. Or even small sessions. Oop. Better put some rounds in. Huh? Um. What? I don't remember. Hmm. Nice. Alright, we're going to investigate. What the hell? I don't remember setting anything. What's going on? Run around the landscape a little bit. But... Whoa! Crunch. Expanded. Unless that's where I looked at last time. I have no idea. Can somebody let me know in the comment section what the heck that flag's for? Because I never set a location. Unless it's to mark a dungeon entrance, but then the dungeon over the other side there should have one as well. Hmm. Yeah, could someone in the comment section let me know why that's come up? Well, that's a rare item. あら、どうも。もっとやりますわ。ずっとありがとう。嬉しいのです。すごいわ。わい。ずっとありがとうです。悪くないわね。僕が悪いまだ。ないのに。ただ、ただ、ただ、ただ、ただ、ただ、ただ
body grab that thing. Who? Straya! Did you throw a grenade? Because somebody threw a grenade. Anyway. I was going to talk about what's happening with the channel after this uh, Let's Play, and I suppose I probably should do that. And I'm just firing. Oh! Headshot! Let me reload. No, we already got the partner, apparently. Nice. Okay, what was my other quest in this area? No, we apparently cut them all. Woohoo! Nice. Uh, you know what? Seeing we're here, let's go ahead and grab a unique enemy. Yeah. Out of the way. Yes, and one of the easiest, best ways to get affinity characters is to give them encouragement when they do something like equipping a power boost or something like that, just to throw that out there. As for what's happening on the channel, let's see, I, ha I think I've mentioned it a couple of times in other videos, but for those who haven't seen those, I'm planning to do some more Let's Plays of other games. Games that I've actually completed, which I will make the Let's Play much easier and it actually will make it easier for me to explain things. But, uh, yeah, those Let's Plays link with games like The Simpsons Hit and Run, The Lord of the Rings, Return as a King, two games I actually love to play. I may, may do some video, just some random videos of The Simpsons Road Rage, just talk, talk over them. Probably with Heredy 13, though they will be. Rather than on my own, but we'll see. 
Yeah, but probably more guys to sort out online games than other games to help people unlock things and stuff like that. And even just little general tip videos as well. Like something I something I found actually quite useful in the past from other YouTubers or sources, as the case may be. I think that was similar to shot that. Thank you. I have a wish for a great time to all that. So I'm watching my box. Or oh, actually, I'm sitting on my metal cap. But, um. Yeah, I'd say. Look forward to more Let's Plays, more tutorial videos. For a second. At the moment, the game's looking at a lot of Return of the King. Uh, Simpsons Hit and Run. Yu Gi Oh! Caps and Monster Colossus. And actually, these small actual guide videos of that as well. Skull Saint Run, think what other games I'm going to. I'll probably do talk talk over um, Burnout 3 takedown as well. I might do a similar thing with Dragon Ball Z, but I've got three just throw a few different videos out. Different sorry, topics on just talk over on certain video games. Yeah, just while me and me and are already uh, playing or one of us one of us is playing and yeah, see where we go for those, but yeah, there'd be more tip videos, but expect some top 10s too. I'm just not as the exact topic, but that's another thing, but I'm planning to do like a top 10 favourite songs, top 10 favourite anime songs. It'll be like a top 10 favourite songs of all time, favorite, and that'll include anime, and it'll be a top 10 songs where it doesn't include anime. Top 10 anime themes, or even anime songs in general. So it could be insert songs like oh, All Across the Nation and Never Gonna Take Me Down from Beyblade. Could be songs like that as an insert, and could be the main anime theme. We'll probably do top 10 main anime themes as well as inserts, and then both, something like that. Probably more top 10 for Sword Art Online characters as well. Uh, let's see, Sword Art Online characters. Oh. Yeah, probably do top 10 for. Pokemon characters, not the uh, yeah things like that. And, yeah, there's not going to be a massive deal changing on the channel, but yeah, just I think I need to expand my Rev Five from Sword Art, but I think that's probably where my niche is JRPG type titles. So there might even be some Dissidia Final Fantasy ENT videos popping up from time to time, maybe. Probably even do some Middle Earth Shadow of War as well. Just random videos if I find something anything I want to. If I find something interesting, I think should be shared, I'll share it via the channel, but if not, well, I might just make videos talking about topics for their idea or something, or even on my own, I'll probably do a few of those. Just not sure right now, as it stands, exactly what topics to cover, but give it, I'll give it some thought. Probably won't start much in a way of dis big discussions until re until things settle down again. Because we've got a couple of events happening in short in the next within probably the next three weeks. So until things settle down up in the aftermath of those, probably won't start any big discussion videos. But let's plays, I don't see why not. But it depends on how far I take this fatal bullet one. I'll probably do. However many parts this ends up being for the main story, I'll do parts for the for both normal endings and the true ending. And I'll probably do more of a dedicated video on the true ending to tell you how to get it. I know how to get it, but or at least roughly how to get it anyway, but I'll do more of a dedicated video to that to get both normal endings, probably. Because I'll have to probably do a little bit of work. But, at this point in time, it for, I'll, say, I'll say this, it revolves around the one important decision in the story. I, I'll give you that, and I'll leave 
No, we'll leave that there for the moment for that. But as for Sword Art Online Hollow Realization, Axo World vs Sword Art Online, you can still expect to see character. At least until they're all done character overviews, they'll probably be. What will they be? <coughs> okay, maybe some. Oh, yeah, there'll be all the weapon guide. Oh, no, weapon skill guides. Probably a guide going over the weapons themselves, showing you what everything looks like. Some of them are actually almost reskins, I have to say, like the different versions of the Kagamitsu G4 Photon Sword. They're just reskins of the blade colour. But, um, yeah, so with that, well, I think that's just about it. There might be maybe some videos on Lost Song, probably character overviews, things like that. Once I get them basically maxed out, I'll probably get them all up to say around 700, because that should give me more than enough to unlock all their abilities. I won't go into their weapon masteries because that just takes too long to level up. It takes long enough to get, you know, 400 to get get skills unlocked. It took me long enough to do it the platinum in the game. That little kid at that one because two handed sword can be slow. Yeah, I did know. And it's nothing else. I was actually, I suppose, Mace is a bit slow for a one handed weapon. Alright. People are shooting all around me. But, um, yeah, I think there'll be maybe some sort of uh, Hollow Fragment videos, which is pretty well, I'd say pretty well expect videos of all the Sword Art Online games, and expect some more Let's Plays. Probably more going back towards PS2 games, I think, than anything, because there's not much I really want to Let's Play at the moment on PS4. I, you could say I got conned into, into this Let's Play. So you could say I got conned, although I was planning on doing videos for Battle anyhow, but maybe not necessarily Let's Play. I was actually look, probably going to do some more guy things to do with the um, bed scenes, but I, I will still do those, but... Is it, 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 oh, well, I suppose you could say romance. It's, it's a little different in this game, but I wouldn't necessarily call it a romance system, per se. We're good at doing their targets. But, um, yeah, I think... I think that's about all I need to add for the channel. And, of course, I suppose I should... I really think I should add this now. Thank you ever so much for all the, all the views and the support through, through the comment section. Because, to be perfectly honest, I never actually thought I'd get so many views on one video in particular, like I did with the whole realization of Attacker Skill Fusion Quest. I mean, I just did that as a guy just to throw out it just in case someone was having trouble, and it turns out it's actually been really successful. And I have to admit that the other Skill Fusion Quest videos I did, they were quite successful too. Not to the extent of that particular one, but I ain't complaining. Even my character, my, uh, my old character in DLC, sh yeah, my character in all DLC showcase for Axel vs. Sword Art Online. Those videos have actually done surprisingly well too. And those shortcut, I think the shortcut guy, and see. You can see for car location, I've hit and run, they're done reasonably well. I'm going to expand more on those when I do the Let's Play, actually. Which is probably something I could have done when I actually did them, but I didn't have the tech really to do it at that point. Now I do. And I really ought to revisit hit and run. Because I was going to do a Let's Play of that, um, pretty well straight up around about my birthday last year. 
and then oh probably actually earlier, I'm going to end July, June, July, and then the, then this whole flipping apocalypse thing hit. So that threw a spanner in that works. It really, really did not help. It didn't help me, and I know it didn't help a lot of the YouTubers that we all watch. Well, I wouldn't necessarily say it affected me big time, but it didn't help with the content that I wanted to create because I didn't know what was going to get flagged and what wasn't. I think even I think even now it's a little bit sketchy as to what will get what will get flagged and what's which what's not going to get flagged. But sometimes you got to take a risk with what's up. Somebody used the healing board. That was a bit more damage than I was planning to take. What I think I'll do is, after this let's play, I'll probably follow it up with either Lord of the Rings Return of the King or Simpsons Hit and Run. But I think what I'll do is I'll give you a break between the two just to freshen up a bit. Freshen up a bit because this, this is going to be a little bit to get through. I don't, I don't mind in the slightest if you have a break at some point you're not less play to watch other videos. We don't need to freshen up another content from time to time, so. No biggie. I mean, sometimes I could be watching a video by, I don't know, watch Heavy and then go across to A plus Star. Gives us some different content. And so, and it, and that can freshen, up, freshen up and then get back to watching Heavy in video. Just, yeah, I just want to have a little bit of a change. I ain't shit this one. You hardly even knew I was there until it lost half its health. I think enemy AI needs to be improved a little bit. Oh, that's another quest complete. Imago to a hornet. We're gonna do a few of those. Two of them actually die. Oh no. Oh dear. Got some more quests. It could be interesting. Some enemies you can't find in certain dungeons, so you may have to go looking. Just thought I'd throw that out there now. Those worms, where are they? Oh, I'll find those. Those worms, they would have been up in this section, I think. Let's go and have a look. We come across some of those other hornets and we'll shoot them down. We'll shoot them dead. And if someone makes a comment on one of my other videos, or has made a comment on one of my videos saying that this is violent, like, well, I'd say that's the premise of the game. This game is designed 
to have you shooting things. It's kind of called Gun Gale Online. Probably should have addressed that in one of my earlier videos. Well, let's tackle some worms. Who's that? Wow, my camera went spazzing there. Apparently, worms can be slow. Watch behind you. Oh, I just got hit from underneath. Oh. Get rid of uh, my Yay! Two down! Right now, he's somebody with a Gatling gun. Good, clear that quest. Yeah, that's the sand one of us now. The world order dispatched these couple of wasps that are around. I shot! Yeah. Boop. I think I got some stuff. I got stuff to pick up. Hey, if you notice, the icon, the small square icons on the map. The stuff you got to pick up. Apparently, I just spawned enemies. Oh no! That's oh, no, all right then. Yeah, let's finish them off. Why not? Let's get my auto aim off. We're kind of here anyway, we might as well. one of the more annoying quests out of the life of the time being. I'm gonna climb this hill. Enemy Get rid of this wasp. Apparently just spawn more. They don't want to stay still. They're probably more intent on poisoning me. <laughs> oh no. Get over here, people. Don't attack them. Ah, close. Strayer. What are you doing? Strayer. You're a worry, Strayer. She is a very, very big one. But anyway, I think with those little, those bit of channel plans outlined, I think we have plenty enough to keep us busy for a few months. <laughs> Actually, a few might be under back when we're the next 12 months, I reckon. Meh. Nah.
see how we go. I hope it all works out for the best. We will see. Anyway, with all, everything being said and done, I'm gonna have to sign off for this episode. So if you liked the video, please be sure to hit that like button and leave a comment down below. And if you loved it, please be sure to subscribe and hit that notification bell to be notified of whenever I upload a video. So until next time, this is Panda0073, smoking up those tires, burning that rubber on out of here, and signing out.